Here's a question from JWE 2012, and it's a question from Physics, paper 1. Consider a thin spherical shell of radius r with its center at the origin, carrying uniform positive surface charge density. The variation from, of the magnitude of electric field and the potential with the distance r from the center is best represented by which graph? So if you draw a spherical shell, that's a spherical shell, and let's say here's the center and that's at the origin and let's say it has a radius r and then the axis the r axis moves on like this this moves on like this and this is the r axis now we know that for for a spherical shell at any point inside let's say here the electric field is going to be zero that's what the shell theorem is about and since the electric field is zero for all points inside this shell, we see that option B and C just won't hold up since they have a non-zero constant electric field. Once you have done that, and we, we want to uh, compare options A and D, we can easily see that in option A, the potential, which is shown by the dotted line, it is a linear function. So as you go away from the center the potential increases and in the case of option d the potential is a straight line and we know we know that we know that this this in since this entire shell has zero electric field inside it we know that the potential at the point exactly at at the surface is going to be equal to the potential anywhere else since if this is point a and this is point b we can write va minus vb as minus uh, there won't be a circle on that integral my bad minus integral of e dot dr and from from b to a and since this electric field is zero everywhere, this integral is going to be zero, and VA is equal to VB for all points inside the shell. And that's what D represents.